वेलकम बैक स्टूडेंट्स टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू डू पेज नंबर सेवेंटी सिक्स एंड सेवेंटी सेवन दैट इज आर्किटेक्चुरल फीट्स हेयर वी विल रीड सम स्पेक्टेकुलर मॉडर्न बिल्डिंग्स एंड स्ट्रक्चर्स सो वी स्टार्ट विद इट द फर्स्ट इज द गुगनहाम म्यूजियम दिस म्यूजियम इज लोकेटेड इन बिलबाव दैट इज इन स्पेन it is an architectural wonder the structure of this museum is complex and abstract and has been hailed as one of the most spectacular buildings of the world it is believed that computer simulations of the buildings structure during its construction period made it possible to build shapes that architects of the periods before the advent of the computers would have probably found impossible to construct this museum is a popular tourist attraction and houses some of the best works of modern art next is chhatrapati shivaji terminus and formerly it was known as victoria terminus in mumbai it is one of the busiest railway stations in india the station was designed in 1887 1888 and bears some resemblance to st pancras station in london the station was named to honor queen victoria and was inaugurated on the date of her golden jubilee in 1887 it has been considered to be a remarkable example of the meeting of two cultures as british arch architects worked with indian craftsmen and in year 2004 the station was declared as world heritage site by unesco next we have al amara palace is a fortress of the moorish monarchs of granada that is spain alhambra means red in the arabic language the outer walls of the palace are built using sun dried bricks made out of fine gravel and clay giving the palace its name the principal courts of the palace are the patio de los leones means court of the lions and patio de los arenas courts of the martels so named because in the center is the fuente de los leones that is fountain of the lions and alabaster basin supported by the figures of 12 white marble lions symbols of courage and strength over 5000 visitors wandered through the restored complex every day next we have the palm islands The Palm Islands are a set of three artificial islands which are shaped like palm trees topped with the crescent. It is located in the Persian Gulf off the coast of UAE. Their construction will add 520 km of beach to the city of Dubai, giving the city more areas of beach than a natural beach would. the rock and sand required to build the islands have been quarried in the uae and dragged from the bottom of the ocean the outer edge of each palms and circling crescent is a large brick water made of rocks placed individually by cranes now next we have the national aquatic center also it is known as water cube it is a fascinating building 
built along the bird's nest or the Beijing National Stadium. The water cube was built to host swimming competitions during the 2008 Summer Olympics. Beside its nickname, the building is a cuboid and not a cube. It is covered with bubble-like structures symbolizing water. The outer wall is based on a structure devised from the natural formation of bubbles in soap form. The structure has a seating capacity of 6,000 people. And at the last, we have Dubai's Burj Al Arab, an astonishing 28-story symbol of new world bling. This glorious building is one of the tallest hotels in the world and is shaped like a billowing sail. And to say it dominates the skyline is an understatement. At night, surrounded by choreographed fountains of water and fire, it is truly spectacular. Marketed as the world's first seven-star hotel, it has a helipad on the roof and over 1,200 staff to serve you. This was all about the architectural feats. Now, students, we have quiz time. So, you will read the clues and name the buildings and structures. First one is this eco-friendly sky Scrapper consumes up to 50% less energy than a comparable office tower. So the answer for this is 30 St. Mary X London. Next, this 13th century temple was constructed from oxidized and withered ferruginous for sandstone. It is the Konark Sun Temple in Odisha. Next, this well-known large glass and metal pyramid is surrounded by three smaller ones. So, it is Love Pyramid in Paris. Last, this is the tallest big wheel in the world. It is High Roller Nevada, United States.